Hey guys, Relictus here. Today we're going to be doing the Mists of Pandaria raids, starting with Mogishan Vault through to the Siege of Orgrimmar. Basically, just trying to see how much gold each of the instances makes, and also um, how quick I can do each of the instances. And um, you can see down the bottom, we've got the gold tracking here and the time. So obviously I can reset that, start that at the start of the instance. And then at the end, calculate the gold per hour made in each of the instances. First up, we're doing Mogashan Vaults. And for those who don't know, it is located here in Mr. Pandaria. It's about you. So I'll start now. So we've just finished Mogushan Vaults, uh, you can see we made a total of 778 gold in 13 minutes 55, 360 gold from items which I'll have to sell in my bag, and then also the 417 gold um, just from looting gold. That comes to 3,356 gold per hour. We're now at Heart of Fear, and if you don't know where that is, uh, it's in the dread wastes of Miss Pandaria. We've just finished Heart of Fear and made a total gold of 1,054. See, 491 of that came from items, uh, bringing that to a total of 6,543 gold per hour with a time of 9 minutes 40. We're now going to do Terrace of Endless Springs, and that is located right where my cursor is in Veil of Eternal Blossoms. Finish the Terrace of Endless Springs with a total of 731 gold. Finish that in 4 minutes 11 seconds, which brings it to 10,496 gold per hour. I'm now at the Throne of Thunder on the Isle of Thunder. And to get here, you just need to start a quest at the Shadowpan Garrison.
just finished the Throne of Thunder, um, getting 1,781 gold on that run, and that equates to 3,792 gold per hour. The run did take quite a long time, um, so that's worth considering. And we are now going to do Siege of Orgrimmar. And for those who don't know where that is, that's in Vale of Eternal Blossoms, just underwater here. So that concludes the five raids from Miss of Pandaria, uh, Siege of Orgrimmar getting 1,993 gold, uh, that one took a very long time, almost 50 minutes, and that was 2,401 gold per hour. So you can see Terrace of Endless Springs having the best gold per hour, then the Heart of Fear, um, Throne of Thunder, and then Mushu Mogushan vaults and then finally uh, Siege of Orgrimmar so I would recommend probably just doing Terrace of Endless Springs and Heart of Fear for the gold per hour these other ones um, yeah do take a long time this will only be 15 minutes a week to do and you'll get a total of 1700 gold and doesn't seem like much but over time that adds up so I hope you enjoyed this video I will be doing other videos also on um, different expansions so this one just focused on Mr. Pandaria.